Welcome Libras to Petrella's Intuitive Insights. This is a brief overview of October 1st to the 15th of 2021. Um, when it comes to the overall energy for the Librians during this particular time, I really feel that uh, there's a lot of uh, heart energy center, the um, opening up the heart, renewing the love, opening up honest, heartfelt prayer. Um, I feel that many of you may be in the midst of making some kind of decisions pertaining to love, going through some dark night of the soul pertaining to love, that's going to need some prayer on the behalf of the Libra. This is where maybe it's the time to, um, if you can, get away for a day or two, and um, maybe away from the electronics uh, uh, society, maybe do a little fasting and prayer. And then with fasting, there's different levels of fasting, Libra. Check out YouTube. There's day fast, fruit fast. Um, however, you need to get your spirit, I mean your physical body and your mental body, in subjected to the spirit. And I feel this is because you have major decisions to make. Um, I feel that many of you are having to move forward with moving forward with bad or shocking news and now you're forced to move forward and you're going to because i feel that you're healing your heart's opening um you're powerful to your devotion you're powerfully devoted and and i feel that this is why i'm getting that feeling libra of going to get holy you know where you need to be and how to get there i feel that um if you don't have a trip planned during this time, you may be planning a trip in the future during this time. I feel something that was closed is going to be opened to the Libra during this particular time. I feel that when it comes to career and finance, something, oh, something that was closed is gonna be opened. Okay, oh, that makes sense, okay. But I see that chains, you're gonna be unchained. So whether you're paying off debt or something significant, and again, prayer. I see so much prayer being offered up when I'm seeing the Libra during this particular time. So that leads me to believe that the Libra is in a crossroads. And if you're not in the crossroads, you could feel the crossroads coming in Libra. Let's see, what do the Libra need to know as they're listening to this video? pertaining to love, romance, relationship, October 1st to the 15th of 2021. Oh, isn't the, the travel card, isn't, let's see what we got here. Okay, so this is love, romance, and relationship. You're cutting away bad habits. Maybe it's people, energies. Maybe at work, the relationship with people at work. You're cutting off something you're gonna take the best and you are gonna leave the rest. And here is the moving forward. And this is the tale of a new love. Now, some of you Librians may say, I'm already in a relationship. I'm in a solid relationship. Well then, you know what? Your solid relationship's gonna be moving forward, deeper and higher. It's going to evolve. Love, romance, relationship. I feel like somebody from your past is going to be coming through again. I feel it could be a friend. Uh, Libra, I, this doesn't necessarily need to be a significant other or romantic relationship. However, I'm not going to limit it either. But I feel like there's an old friend. And it, either you're the man and that carry the masculine energy or this masculine energy is coming forward as the friend that's coming back through around. Is it in the Libra's best interest? Ooh. Libra, I would say no. Let that relationship go. Love, romance, relationship, Libra. 
yeah some of you have this is why this dark night of the soul in the relationship because some of you have some kind of broken relationships now whether this is with your adult children this could be with a significant other close friends relatives of some sort somebody that's close to you and it's uh, almost like family quarreling and enough's enough libra what do the libra need to know as they're listening to this video pertaining to love romance relationship libra yeah okay libra all right and then we're going to move on it seems as if things have been status quo with the libra well when things do start moving forward they're going to start moving quickly so even though you might be saying i feel stuck the libra might be saying i feel stuck well there's all the shifting of this energy libra i'm going to go ahead and stick these in different areas of the deck and we're going to go on with career and finance libra career and finance october 1st to the 15th of 2021 what do the librians need to know as they're listening to this video pertaining to love romance i mean career and finance career and finance libra Ooh. okay all right libra Ooh. okay look there's something that you're unaware of that's going to come forward. So maybe this is something to do with finances coming forward. This could be with your career, but something you're not sure of, something that you don't know. You may have a hunch, but you don't really know. You're going to be getting news. This mystery will be solved, Libra. However, something financially is broken and it is going to come to an end. You ready for this? I feel like the end is dead. And I know that's a blanket. I know at every reading, everybody wants the love romance and all the money coming in in the world. I get that. This, these cards do indicate that you're gonna be getting rid of debt. This is about finance and career. This isn't about love and romance and different relationships. This is riches. Riches coming in for the Libra. <laughs> So that backs up that something that was broken, this could have been in your automobile was broken, your refrigerator broke. There could be so many things that this finance needs to step in to repair and it is going to repair it for you, Libra. This is beautiful when it comes to career and finance. Career, I mean, overall, anything else overall that the Libra need to pay attention to. Okay, Libra, we know if it, I, I'm going to get a lot of comments below. I know a lot of the Libra and a lot of the other signs do believe that a snake could be just transition, but I really feel that this is um, a coming out with this cattiness card. I really feel that you need to pay attention to who and what you're paying attention to, Libra. Um, it's time for you to strengthen and heighten your awareness and your intuition. Let's call it, it's time to get holy. You know, go within, practice in prayer, practice your meditations, get that holiness to a vibration to where you could feel or sense or just know there's some negativity around you and you need to deal with it. But overall, Libra, this has been an absolutely good reading. Um, I feel that your love and your romance are all meeting at another level now, like a crossroads level. Uh, there's a sense of success with the Libra. Pay attention. If it sounds like a snake and it looks like a snake, it could be a snake. Uh, if this resonated with you, please click like, share, and subscribe. Uh, private readings, patrellasintuitiveinsights.com. It's listed in the link below. And also Libra, um, I, I just wanted to say that when it comes to you being blessed, because I do feel that you're working with this heart energy center and this attitude of gratitude, that's gonna bring more blessings to you and you already know that. 
So work with that energy because I feel that that's the energy that you're going to have during this particular time. With that, God bless you.